Yes, 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 yes. By the way, I'm just happy to get in this like where ribbon is not bent. That's all, by the way. Yes, I shaved. What do you guys think? Did I do a good job? I think so, right? I shaved myself. I didn't full shave it. I just trimmed it. Ah, oh, now AP Yango. AP Yango. AP Yango. Bro. bro, you are too happy for a League of Legends player. It's because I won my last game. No, bro, I have three champions that can start a fight for me. Please, no dodge. We go scaling into this. So, guys, in the past, what I would do to Cassante is I look to uh, is, is I look to kill him, but it just doesn't work. So I just play this and I full out scale him. Every move you made, I was watching you. All right, guys, lock in, focus. Focus, 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 focus. I like your energy, Alois. Yeah, wait till I lose a few games in a row, bro. <laughs> Uh-oh, pro, 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 winnable. Zach, the only problem with Zach is that he has very low um, early game strength. So Zach is actually amongst my favorite junglers to play with because he has AP damage and he has insane gank potential and he has very good um, engage later on in the game. The only downside is his weak early game. Oh, Talia, oh, Ari. Oh, Ari, you don't want that, baby. And now I just look for priority, by the way. I'm looking for perfect chess this game, okay? T1 Academy top. <gasps> Shit! I lose both. Okay, I lose one. Not good though. Yeah, he's just looking for grass proc. That's alright though. He did wolves grown blue, I think. Very strange path thing here. Oh, Zek gets his first blood, I think. Nice. Ari's playing that aggressive without flesh. That's interesting. Okay. <laughs> it's level 4 from that one. I'm letting him stack grass the whole game though. He's already gotten six. Yeah, there's not much to do about that though. Why? Well, I've never dodged Kisante W in my life. I didn't know that ability is dodgeable. Next wave gives us level six exact more. Bottle is down in a lot of CS. I think the triple longsword is better, so I get maximum flat AD. Okay, my bot lane is getting stomped. That sucks. My bot lane lost 2v2. My mid lane is stomping theirs, but my bot lane is getting stomped 2v2. Okay, so we have a win condition through that guy. Their win condition is bot lane. Luckily, Thresh has the kills. Okay. <laughs> what is that damage, my guy? He just 100 zeros me. All right. I think I'm just out before he arrives. He doesn't have tabbies. Wait, he does? Solo kill T1 Academy top later, by the way! Goodbye! Do I go for Mercs this game? I feel like I should, but I'll get Death Sense first. I need to get Mercs, and then I'll just have Magic Resist for the Ari, and I won't invest anything else into Magic Resist. I'll go Death Sense, Mercs, Eclipse Under the Sky, something like this. Bro. That's a big shutdown if we get it. That was clean last thing. Thresh could come top here. 
I get level 11 here, I should beat him really hard. They have Tubu, Tubu, Double Dragon, which I really dislike. We're gonna cross map here, they're making a play on top, so I'll back off. Well. Kinda annoying though, bot lane gap is so large, all they have to do is farm. I would feel like that was extremely obvious though, that their bot lane is coming from base, they're just like playing it in their bot lane's tempo. My team is just monster tilting, like I can carry this game so easily. I think they've kind of made it impossible now though. It was winnable with just bot lane losing, but my mid laner has died four times in a row now. Their mid laner was 0-4, he's 5-5 now, and they're gonna get third dragon. They just don't have ult. I get double shot down, baby. I play it perfect. Not perfect, but I play it. Really good! And now we get dragon. That is their win condition gone. And now my team gets some motivation because they see that I'm like full giga chat. Oh! Baby! Please go. Oh. Stop broken. But team, please. Pentakill. Where's my pentakill teammate? Find target. GG, go, 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 go. What a greedy, wait, like, he already is one-shotting people. Let me go Cleaver, bro. Okay, now my AD carry has three items, so he's actually useful. Give me my LP, please. I deserve it. I shot singing. I mean, those are pretty hard skill shots to land. And that thrash does that. I gotta do everything, man. Why is my Varus walking here? Like, like, what a criminal! Why did you split up from your team and get hit by a thrash hoop? Anyways, we won the fight because I'm him! Yo, my teammates are the reason I'm fat and my teammates are the reason I have a headache. And that's just plain truth. If I'm in loser's queue, I want to eat. So they make me fat. Did we kill? You go back in. Nah, I swear you have to. I'm playing with pros, by the way, but they're just griefing. Oh. I could have moved. Death stance? No, it's not enough. I wanted to flash out to W the Jinx, but they peeled it really, really well. I also made a mistake there, though. I played that shit. Oh! Yes! Yes, team! I could've, I could've, uh, uh, I had the four man flash, uh, I should've E flash W, and then I get Jinx and four others. But because I did a different combo, I got hooked, and then insta CC'd.
That guy gives a reset to Viego and Jinx. Their drops just need one reset and they get Jinx, Viego, reset and it's GG. That's really good damage. Nice! Oh, my Zek just predicts that? I'm uh, not that large, I guess. I just griefed. Alright, my team finally played one team fight well, guys. My team finally put it off. Finally! <laughs> they ping me! Yay! We carried the piggies! Oh. I told you can win! I dropped this good! Viego top? Katarina top? I think I just play this. And I will outskill anybody this game. If I get 10 cents per minute into their draft with this setup, I'll win. If it's Rumble top... I get to somewhat play the game. If it's Katarina Viego top, I don't really get that much kill pressure with this, but I would skill them after one item. I don't necessarily need to kill this guy. I would skill, bro. Top can close map. Sure, I'll do map cover. Okay, I play one game map cover. If I can get priority, I will. Getting priority for free like this is very nice. I just get to play for perfect CS. At least it is bad to get to bot. He's right there, 12 CS, so he's just full clearing the bot. I don't want to fight that much, I just want to play for perfect CS. I outskilled, I dropped very hard. So I don't need to look for any risks during laning phase. And if I farm very well, I might even get a lead through that. Listen died in his bot side. So now he might come top side for the scuttle. So me securing cryo perma is like annoying for the Viego, right? This Viego is not really contesting me as all, at all. He can fight me in lane. She's not doing it, so. Okay, he did this. So I'm gonna try and take the scuttle now, and then Lee Sin has nothing. I think he's in time to actually stop me from taking this, maybe. It's all right, we're getting a CS lead. I outskill when we drop extremely hard, so we're chilling. Now I gotta set up my reset, so. We slow push this wave, and this wave I will hard push. Sin's out, bot. Now I can go to any item. My cast is 4 and 0, which is amazing. I get level 6 on this wave. I haven't lost any bit of XP, but so does he. Not the best item here, but I'm CDR maxing. He gets 6. Nice, nah, just running away from me. I'm not gonna chase there. Shouldn't have TP'd, I think, either. I think I kind of I kind of griefed. I'm thinking about too many things. I was watching bot lane. Okay, I'm very happy I went for uh, call feuds, because now I can rush Cleaver. Because this guy is going Tabby's first, right? So now I just go Cleaver. And it's alright. I proxy this wave, get tempo, probably set up the next reset. I don't think I can die here. Okay. I got her ignite, so she gets no kill pressure now. There's a plant here, we're chilling. Goldman seems to be dead. As long as Cassio doesn't die, we're chilling. It's very nice. Okay, this guy's going lethality. This guy's AD, this guy's AD. All don't have true damage, right? So I go cleaver to counter this Tabis. And then I'll have Death Stance, CDR boots, and Maul for these two, as GG. Beautiful. In 600 gold, I start winning the 1v1. Right now, he kinda has the edge, cause he has Tabis, Temporal Spike. Once I had this, I'm stronger. Lee Sin has no camp, so he could look for me. Shouldn't use my potion. Okay, we have our item, guys. Now we're strong. Uh, again, I get haste from this, this. I have ability haste in my runes and gathering storm. So I've went for a scaling setup here. And that's why I am very content with just farming even. He spent his spike to go for Tavis first. I counteract that. Now I have 38 haste already, which just being level 9, one item. Now I go CDR boots and death stance and maul. And I'm going to be unstoppable, right? Death stance against this, this, this. Maul against this and this. And yeah, it's GG. I've ever said I need. We have a CS lead. We have two plates. We're slowly building a lead here. I have TP here, maybe. 900 gold is my next reset. I mean, my team wins without me. <laughs> That's beautiful, too. I'll take it. Didn't need it, but hey, very nice. I'll take it. So now I have 53 ability haste, but I also have 6 haste here. So I have 60 haste, meaning I can just Q delay. As in, if I press my Q right now and I full extend it, it will instantly be back up. Like, yeah, I don't fully extend it. But basically, I can get it back instantly. And that means that I can fight him right now and easily move on him. And then we go death stance. I don't need any other haste.
Okay, I didn't expect Rumble. I mean, their only realistic win condition is Katarina. And once I get Maul, that guy is not a win condition. I gotta respect more, I guess. There was a TP here. Okay, they're gonna perma target me. You gotta play it out clean. I just gotta be a complete bitch and not do anything because all you can do is look for shutdowns on me. I win the 1v1 very easily, but it's never a 1v1 this game. Yeah, the whole squad is coming here again, by the way. They hate my ass. Oh my. What the? Where did they come from? I can't really follow that. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. GG. Uh. Okay, shouldn't, shouldn't use my abilities like that. They're just probably... Sorry, sorry, sorry. Nini dying is really bad because not only do I give a kill, I also lose a tier 2 top and I should have maybe been top in general. That's just really, really sad. I don't think we can do much here, buddy. Well. They are playing very well from behind, I gotta give it to them. They're permissing traps and I've fallen for them. I'm still strong, but me dying on bot lane with the third dragon, that was the biggest blunder, because I also gave them a tier two. But then we died mid. I th we're still ahead, but Skaterina is actually playing so well. Their perma moving is five as well. What is that? Well, we're losing this game somehow. I'm probably getting 5-man this game. I can't really do much. I died twice like an idiot, I guess. Dice, I, twice I made a mistake. This death, this death was bad, and there was one death in top lane I could have avoided. Can we get third dragon? It's pretty massive. Mars is for items, though. I'm half HP already. I don't think I can do much more to the fight like that. The Vardos just one shots my ass with every Q. What? What? Why? What is my jungler doing? What's he seen me for so long? Oh, he's dead. Okay, since I wasn't even in the fight, by the way. I don't know what my jungler is doing the whole game, but that guy is like cooking something.
right then. I've so little kill participation, but I don't know, it's such a weird game. I'm pretty good against our draft, I just Varsh just makes the game so hard to play. Shoot them, boys! I'm bringing out the big guns here. What my smiley sin was since I'm doing the whole game. For real, though. They guys perma griefing it. Let me play my game! I'm getting picked everywhere. It's like I have a mom watching over me this game, man. I win their sidling super hard. Let me play my fucking game. Stop pinging me for every little step that I take. I'm a grown man too. Grown, grown woman, grown woman, grown woman this game. Let me play my stupid game, man. I'm telling you I'm fine. I know I had to lock in though, I'm very good against our draft. I think I just made one too many mistakes, like dying for random stuff. I think we can end. Okay, no, maybe not. We got that guy. He dies with- no, he doesn't die to death stance. I did die. What am I getting pinged again for? This game should not be this hard. I've already did not too shabby bro, not too shabby. Alright guys, let's one shot some piggies! <laughs> Riven, Riven, you like a Azzy. Call me Azzy, let's go. Riven open can win. Action is like, you get me, Riven piggy. To be honest, I'd mute you. You type so much. I just want to win. Who are we playing with, huh? Who are we playing with? How many pros? Two pros, they have one pro. Winnable. I will scale into their team. 10 cents per minute, I carry. 10 cents per minute. I think this is AP Shake, okay, see his Dark Harvest. AP damage, AP damage. This guy does like whatever damage. 80 damage. It's alright. All I need is 10 cents per minute. We focus on farming. Farming, I skill, scaling, I carry. Let's go. I still have beard. I just trimmed it. What a shit call. My lady is so far behind now. Why would you go for that so late? He already has all the boxes set up. Such a shit call. Alright, decent early lane. That was criminal that I get away with that.
We just can't fight this, bro. Just run. I'll try to set up my own reset instead of freezing. I could go Ravenous Hydra this game, maybe. It's not a bad Ravenous Hydra game at all. And I'll just farm the entire map and outskill that way. And the reason I ult here is because it will also give me tempo on this wave and I can look for the plant or for a reset. We trade ult, but it's fine. And I can look for the bots. Okay, well, Bolden is winning, GG. Okay, I actually just reset. I could look for the plant and I'm full HP, but it's okay. We just trade ult. And it sets up my reset like a tempo. So I'm completely fine to ult like that. I do think I want to try Ravenous Hydra this game. I think it's one game where it's actually fine. And again, the reason I like a Ravenous Hydra this game is because against either side lane, it's just going to be more so farm oriented. Against Skarner, against Oriana. And if I just get to monster farm this game, I'll go Ravenous Hydra, Maul, Cleaver, Death Stance. Or I just go Eclipse. That was a very good strategy that I used though. All inning, not necessarily to kill the Oriana, but to just secure my reset. Oh, I'll go Eclipse. Oriana got a lot from that. Very nice to get the better AD this game. All right, there's just five homies. I would have wanted Ravenous Hydra this game, but I think I regret it now, but I won't regret it once I hit Death and Small. Once I have Death and Small, I'm gonna be super strong this game. This game, we just have better team. Very, very nice. I'll fix World Wave. Their mid wave is bouncing, their bot wave is bouncing. I'll move here. We have Locket still. I mean, I said already in draft one team gets Shaco, one team gets Lilia. Should have kept pushing bot, but it's alright. Now they can't do anything extra. Bolt wave will bounce. I fix mid wave again. What is flesh shako? They do have insane combo with Rakan or Twitch by the way. That combo is crazy. This time I keep pushing I think. No, I recall. Maybe I should just start grouping, but I don't know. Probably should have been there. Probably should have been there. My carry that twice now. Enemy is just probably walking as five. I can maybe fight this with the Rek'Sai. Eh? Mm, no, we shouldn't. I mean, I could group, but my team could also just play slower. 
Like we're getting perma caught. Like we're, we're not really hard winning this game anymore. How does Lilia die eight times? And we are creeping a lot. My depth is healing. Nobody's dying. Nice. We're just playing for kills the whole game. Both our silence are completely effing cooked. Nah, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I should stop type. We have no flashes. I use my TP now too for nothing. Are we legit dead mid again? We again don't recall. <laughs> These guys are criminals, man. But oh well, I'm dead. At this point, I, I'm literally just tilted. But I'm watching. Scarner so balanced. What a disgusting game. Oh, we're already fighting. No, pull him into the AD carry. Please die. Or I just ult herself. What a disgusting game. <laughs> Wait, Chaco's alive. Oh no. Alright. Twitch is here somewhere. He's walking to this bush. I'll find him. I can smell this cheesy bastard. We are fighting. Oh, good for you. I'm still tanking. All right, we win. What a nasty game, man. What a disgusting game. This is why so many games in Korea are still winnable because people just get to brawl like it's nothing. All my team had to do this game is just play chill, but we just kept fighting like... Comp like, how does Lilia die 10 times against this draft? Can anybody figure that out? How do you die 10 times against this? Oh, you, you don't want to end? Yeah, 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 I won't end, bro. I won't end. I won't end. I won't end. Don't worry about it, bro.